Muggs Media presents exclusive coverage, New Jersey State Fair, Sussex County Farm and Horse Show, show number four. Once again, big thank you to our sponsors and our title sponsor, steelproducts.com. Visit your local steel dealer like Sparta Hardware and Montague Tool and Die. My host, my co-host is Nicole Borville. Oh. Hi, Muggs. How you doing, Nikki? <laughs> Muggs. Oh. Muggs, what are you doing? Why do you always do that? I get that chest pain every once in a while. <laughs> oh, Muggs, your daughter's here today watching this, this broadcast. I'm sure she'll be on the show to imitate you soon. Yeah, she was. She watched it last night. What'd she say? She said she saw my underwear when I did the sausage sandwich, man. And it wasn't good? It was a, it was a un, very unpretty sight. Yes. What's this guy doing? probably a little embarrassed. Just drive right in front of us. We're not taping here. Just drive right in. <laughs> Give me a break, buddy, huh? Okay, right there. So your daughter said she was embarrassed of you? Yeah, she of, said, ooh, I saw his times. underwear. Yeah, well, she's always embarrassed of me. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, my wife was always embarrassed of me. Oh, Muggs. So here we are again at the fair show number four, folks. How fast it's gone already. Yeah, I, I love it here. I'm grateful to be here, grateful to our sponsors. Yes, we are having a great time. The sun, yeah, still hot. The humidity has calmed down a little bit. It's a great time to come out and show your support to the New Jersey State Fair, the Sussex County Farm and Horse Show. That's right. Now, Muggsy, we have a great show. This is one of our most popular shows around. It's the Queen Show, all love right? It. Love it. Yeah. And this year, a lovely girl, they're always so lovely, but this year, a lovely girl, her name is Sharon Kleindienst. Now, if I say that wrong, I'm going to get it right in the uh, in when we do the segment. Sweetheart, Miss Stillwater. Miss Stillwater, the title of Nick, <laughs> Nikki Morville, is could mad never, because she could never, could, hold. could never get that title. <laughs> she lost Miss Stillwater and affected the rest of her life. <laughs> <laughs> I still don't understand it. You know, it makes a little more sense when I meet these girls because they are so put together and well-rounded. I wasn't at that age. I was still like, woohoo, what do I do with my life? These girls were like, they know what they want. They're in the National Honor Society. Oh yeah, they're all very, uh, very smart girls. Yeah. They'll have boyfriends though. I'm like, boyfriend. What's that about? I know. But you know what? <laughs> She's very loyal to her boyfriend. She's a sweet girl. She's going to college, she's got a great mom. Check her out, the 2012 Queen of the Fair. Alrighty folks, it is our big show, the Queen Show. I am here with the Queen of the Fair, Sharon Kleindienst, Miss Stillwater, 2012. How exciting, folks. <laughs> another year, another beautiful queen. So Sharon, first tell me a little bit about this getting involved with the pageant. Is this something you've always wanted to do? It is actually something I've only wanted to do for the past couple of years. Mm -hmm. My I missed it my junior year, and I was encouraged by my parents and my boyfriend and my friends to go for Miss Stillwater, and I actually didn't send in the papers until the day it was all due because <laughs> I was on the line about debating about doing it, and I'm so glad that I ended up doing it um, because I won Miss Stillwater, as seen. And I never thought that I would have been the queen of the fair. Mm -hmm. Like I absolutely never thought that that would have been me. So I was absolutely flabbergasted. And here you are, uh, Miss <laughs> Stillwater, queen of the fair. Now, as I understand, you just graduated Kittatinny, my old alma mater. And I understand you are going to be going to Mansfield College. Yes. Tell Mans us a little bit about that. What are you going to do there? Um, at Mansfield University, I'm going to study elementary education mm -hmm. with a um, minor in studio art with dual certification in special ed. Big mouthful. Woo! <laughs> it's Whoa. just one major and one minor, and I'm hoping to study abroad in either Australia or New Zealand. And I'm also part of the honors program. And Oops. then the, I move in um, the end of this month for two weeks of band camp because I am going to do color guard. Uh, at Mansell University and I missed it by one year but they are actually in England right now because they were asked to perform at the Summer Olympics. Now a part of this day is we have to go lucky us we have to sample some food Ooh. do some games <laughs> please tell me you eat you oh eat? yes oh okay, i good. love to eat because i can't take a girl to just eat salad my boyfriend was joking with me and we were on our way back <laughs> from canada and we were the whole bunch of friends and we were at buffalo bills and <laughs> all the some of the girls got those salads and i was like no, no i want my pulled pork salad sandwich that's my and type of girl <laughs> I well love sharon Pizza and chicken. I, I grew up you with an Irish mother and an Irish German father and <laughs> so family. You eat. Yes. Thanksgiving, I always walk away and I feel like I have a food baby, as we all joke. And our and our um, my biology teacher, he used to always joke, don't 
Don't go into a turkey coma, and I <laughs> usually do because I have so much. Well, I am good. not. Well, a... then you are going to fit in perfect here today because we're going to go eat some food <laughs> oh, and have some fun, okay? <laughs> awesome. All right. Okay, so here we are. We're going to try our luck at a basketball toss now. The queen doesn't play too many sports. No. She's on the other side of things. I play sports, but I'm really never good at basketball. She'll probably be better than so me. So let's see. All right, let's go, sweetie. Oh, oh my! Try one more. Let's see what we got. All right. All right. Let me try. All right. See what happens. I know. Oh. Take one more shot. Okay. <laughs> we can do this. All right. You're up. Getting better. Oh. All right. Let's see. Oh, oh so close. Well, the queen and I have yet, we have one more thing in common and neither of us can play basketball. No. So let's <laughs> do something sure. we both enjoy is eating. Yes. We'll meet you at the food. Okay, so now here we are. My favorite part of the segment is the food part. And as we always do, we yeah, stop by Bob's it. place. And Bob's place, he's retired. Finally, Bob is finally relaxing. You go to the beach, Bob? A little bit. Good. That's okay. what you should be doing. Just came back from Florida. See, I love this guy. Bob, he's got my heart. So in the meantime, we've got right where Bob's place used to be. And what's your place called? World's Best Sunday. World's Best Sunday. And who doesn't like a hot fudge Sunday? So the queen and I. Are forced to have hot fudge sundaes. Queen, enjoy. Mm. Delicious, lovely. Especially on a hot afternoon. Stop by on the midway, right over here, right on the corner, right before you get to all the rides and games. Mm. Fantastic, right? Yes. So this queen wanted to end our shoot this year over by the 4-H, and I thought that was great because. Why not give the 4-H's some more publicity? And yeah. I agree, you love the sheep, so that's where we are. Yes. They have your heart? Yes, I do. Uh, my, my best friend, she has some sheep, and they're actually right over there, those first two stalls. And that's wonderful. I love the sheep, and I feel that um, the agriculture of this fair should be more represented because that's what this fair started out as, mm -hmm. a, a show for the farmers, and it means a lot to me to be able to finish here. Right. <laughs> she said it best lovely mom that you have too, Thank honey, you. really, what, what it's all. Nice family. So folks, here we are, 2012, we've got Miss Stillwater, Queen of the Fair. She's a lovely girl. Stop by and say hi to her. She'll Please do. She'll certainly, you know, talk to you all this week and, and then good luck at college and beyond. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. I'd like to thank our sponsors. Let, let's lead off this commercial break with Box Home Healthcare Supply. This is what you need to know about Box Home Healthcare Supply. What we'd like to do is consider ourselves a full-stop shop. Basically, we have a showroom in Hackettstown. It's right on Main Street in Hackettstown. Uh, it's got full service for everything from pediatrics to geriatrics. We can do everything from a complex power wheelchair right on down to orthotic fittings for, for feet, uh, for uh, diabetic shoes, for inserts for diabetic shoes, knee braces, back braces, and everything in between, whether it be blood pressure, or diabetes, or any condition you have, we basically have something we can take care of with you. Our staff is fully trained to be able to assist anyone with any kind of insurance they possibly have. We may not always have the right answer for them based on your insurance, but we'll certainly work with your insurance company. We cover everything from the New York border right down to Trenton. We go into the Poconos and as far as New York City. We want to make sure that you're taken care of by local people, local healthcare people that are willing to assist you in every step of the way to get you home safely and to get you rehabilitating as rapidly as possible so that the outcome we can provide to you is the best possible outcome there is. Box Home Healthcare Supply. Imagine life at Bristol Glen, a continuing care retirement community offering independent living, assisted living, and skilled nursing care on one campus. Bristol Glen provides activities that keep the mind, body, and spirit energized. Located in scenic Newton, New Jersey, Bristol Glen has something for every taste. So call or visit today. Celebrate life at Bristol Glen, United Methodist Homes, excellence in senior living. Where dedication is a tradition, a helping hand in a time of need. The family that's brought you comfort for over a century. I live for Gerald.
Our coverage of a state fair is sponsored in part by Warren Distributing. Miller Lite sponsors the outdoor entertainment area. Visit the beer tent at the state fair. Remember, drink responsibly. And 21 means 21. It has a high performance German engine, the world's most sophisticated braking system and uncompromising standard safety features. All for less than $200 total. The Steel MS-170. Available only at your local steel dealer. Welcome back, Mugs Media exclusive coverage. You notice I said Mugs Media, I didn't mention that other media outfit we used to be tied up with. We're on our own now, as you probably know out there in Sussex County and thriving, and uh, thanks to our sponsorship, people will believe in our programming. We're not just pointing a camera somewhere aimlessly and shooting things, we're actually producing quality programming, so. We have a lot of great next? people who work at Mugs Media, and here we are rolling it out again here at the fair. Next, we've got Kids Day, Mugs. Oh. Kids Day, and we went and visited uh, Norwest Cap, and Sharon Giacchino, lovely lady, and Norwest Cap does so much good around this county, Yes, they Mugs. do. I mean, so much, and she gave us the rundown of everything, so check it out. This is actually our 15th annual Noest Cap Kids Day, and it's just so much fun because you get to bring the whole community together, and when you think back 15 years ago, there weren't all the activities. Now there's so much we hear on Children's Day at the fair that people can come, but under the tent, all the activities are free. They're fun, they're hands-on activities, and then we also have some shows, and of course, our favorite Rizzo's Reptiles at 11.45. And um, this year, I actually had some fun because I got to bring my grandchildren here. So that was the first time. And that they're is special. Yes, it is, and um, I, I just love it. And um, they just had a little, give mommy and daddy a day off because yeah. they had a little boy a week ago. So, oh. I mean, it really is just special for me today. Awesome. Awesome. And well, then, you've got a lot to be excited about. I do. I do. <laughs> and then, uh, but you know, we have Home Depot and Lowe's. They do these kits with the kids. They bring like 500 kits, wow. and you hear tat, tat, tat all day long. So that's really kind of awesome. We have a lot of water play this year to keep kids cool and ways to teach them a lot of health and safety. And it's all about growing up healthy in Sussex County this year. Also, here at Kids Day, we have two adorable little kids. We have Tyler Atkins son and daughter, Noah and Madeline, and they are absolutely adorable, and he got some really cute shots of them enjoying the fair.
All right, Tyler, you have two beautiful children there. Good luck. Uh, as I told you, when you were having your kids, your life is over once you have a kid, right, Gina? <laughs> <laughs> I forget. I got two. Yeah, I she's know. got two. Every time I call her, there's two kids in the background. <laughs> screaming. Two girls. What, what do you think is going to happen? It's high drama when you have a girl. Very high drama. <laughs> <laughs> all, drama all the time. Oh, Me, the girls, oh. we got the female cat. We got the one dog. That's it. My my male dog in the house, Bruce, and he's the biggest wimp of them all. Oh. Lots of lost your vegetables. Your poor estrogen. husband. <laughs> He's cooked. <laughs> He's cooked. He His is. life is over. <laughs> Just like yours. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right, Mugs. Only let's kidding, Jim and Joy. <laughs> let's honor our sponsors. Let's lead off with the place where I'm going to be laid up at. I live for Giro. This is a family run and operated business, and you are, in fact, coming to our home. Mm -hmm. So it is a home setting um, and is decorated accordingly. Everything has to be coordinated so that it's seamless and flawless so that the, the people and the general public don't they don't feel any pressure. I live for Gerald. This is what you need to know about Box Home Healthcare Supply. What we'd like to do is consider ourselves a full stop shop. Basically, we have a showroom in Hackettstown, it's right on Main Street in Hackettstown. Uh, it's got full service for everything from pediatrics to geriatrics. We can do everything from a complex power wheelchair right on down to orthotic fittings for, for feet, uh, for uh, diabetic shoes, for inserts for diabetic shoes, knee braces, back braces, and everything in between, whether it be blood pressure or diabetes or any condition you have, we basically have something we can take care of with you. Our staff is fully trained to be able to assist anyone with any kind of insurance they possibly have. We may not always have the right answer for them based on your insurance, but we'll certainly work with your insurance company. We cover everything from the New York border right down to Trenton. We go into the Poconos and as far as New York City. We want to make sure that you're taken care of by local people, local healthcare people that are willing to assist you in every step of the way to get you home safely and to get you rehabilitating as rapidly as possible so that the outcome we can provide to you is the best possible outcome there is. Bucks, home health care supplies. Imagine life at Bristol Glen, a continuing care retirement community offering independent living, assisted living, and skilled nursing care on one campus. Bristol Glen provides activities that keep the mind, body, and spirit energized. Located in scenic Newton, New Jersey, Bristol Glen has something for every taste. So call or visit today. Celebrate life at Bristol Glen, United Methodist Homes, excellence in senior living. I can work hard all day, every day if I have to, but I don't plow fields, harvest crops, or milk cows. I'm no farm hand. I'm the farm boss from steel. The number one selling brand of chainsaw in the world. Are you ready for me? Are you ready for a steel? Welcome back, Mugs Media, exclusive coverage, New Jersey State Fair. And uh, speaking of Isla Fragero on the commercial break, Gina watched that commercial and goes, what is that a commercial for? Oh, that's hard to explain. Yeah. I'm sure you put it very eloquently. I said it's a funeral work. home. That's exactly. All right. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> Mugs, here we are at the fair, one of the best deals at the fair, the Boy Scout tent. You that's love right. it. That's right. I love it. It's cheap, right up my alley. I right the egg sandwich yep. and the coffee. Two dollars, dollar here yep. for a what? I mean, you really can't even find a dollar water here. Yeah, I know. Well, that's where we're going. Gina, we're gonna to go to the Boy Scout tent because it's the cheapest. Daddy's gonna treat you to yeah. a nice, nice lunch, Gina. So here we are at the Boy Scout tent. We're here with Sharon Roach at the Boy Scout tent, folks. As you know, I'm a big believer. It's supporting with nonprofits here at the fair. They have breakfast here. They have lunch. You can get dinner here. Tell us about your menu, Sharon. Uh, we have some new items on our menu this year. We have a Southwest Turkey Burger. We have a vegetable burger. We have our Philly steak sandwiches. We have our, a lot of chicken sandwiches, chicken salads, chicken wraps. Our sodas are the cheapest in the fair. Waters, we have muffins, egg sandwiches, pancakes. I think we have just about anything you guys need and we can give it to you, we deliver. And our good friend, Mr. Dan Cleary. Love this assignment, the 4-H Swine Show. Today we have our market and guilt show and Market is selling our pigs in auction, so hopefully one of us, we're twins, will get Grand or Reserved or maybe take both. It, when you get like Grand or Reserved, you get to sell in auction first, so 
usually want to get that. So you get to sell your pig and the buyers like the first ones, the winners. So it takes about six months to raise them at this point and you want them to be like good weight is like 230 to a, a little less than 300 and um, feeding them daily and just checking up on them, making sure they're clean and having a good lifestyle to get a good pig to sell. What's the most fun about doing this? Mainly, I love when we're in the arena and the pig first gets in there and they just start running around like crazy. It's the best part. It just makes everyone laugh. So, How long have you guys been doing this? This is actually our 10th year, I'm pretty yeah. sure. We've been in Forge for a long time. It's, like we're it's a lot of fun. It's like a behind the scenes of the fair, so it's a lot of fun. I think we should go to a break. <laughs> Folks, we'll be right back right after this. We are steel. German engineered chainsaws and landscape products. The majority of which are made here in America by Americans. And exported to over 90 countries around the world. Find out why steel is number one in America at steelusa.com. Where dedication is a tradition, a helping hand in a time of need. The family that's brought you comfort for over a century. I live for Jero. This is what you need to know about Box Home Healthcare Supply. What we'd like to do is consider ourselves a full stop shop. Basically, we have a showroom in Hackettstown, it's right on Main Street in Hackettstown. Uh, it's got full service for everything from pediatrics to geriatrics. We can do everything from a complex power wheelchair right on down to orthotic fittings for, for feet, uh, for uh, diabetic shoes, for inserts for diabetic shoes, knee braces, back braces, and everything in between, whether it be blood pressure or diabetes or any condition you have, we basically have something we can take care of with you. Our staff is fully trained to be able to assist anyone with any kind of insurance they possibly have. We may not always have the right answer for them based on your insurance, but we'll certainly work with your insurance company. We cover everything from the New York border right down to Trenton. We go into the Poconos and as far as New York City. We want to make sure that you're taken care of by local people, local healthcare people that are willing to assist you in every step of the way to get you home safely and to get you rehabilitating as rapidly as possible so that the outcome we can provide to you is the best possible outcome there is. Bucks. Imagine life at Bristol Glen, a continuing care retirement community offering independent living, assisted living, and skilled nursing care on one campus. Bristol Glen provides activities that keep the mind, body, and spirit energized. Located in scenic Newton, New Jersey, Bristol Glen has something for every taste. So call or visit today. Celebrate life at Bristol Glen, United Methodist Homes, excellence in senior living. Our coverage of a state fair is sponsored in part by Warren Distributing. Miller Lite sponsors the outdoor entertainment area. Visit the beer tent at the state fair. Remember, drink responsibly and 21 means 21. Welcome back, Mugs Media, exclusive coverage of Jersey State Fair, Sussex County Farm and Horse Show. The opening ceremonies were held. Yes. And our good friend Alan Henderson, the president of the fair, who last year was the president of the New Jersey State Fair, Sussex County Farm and Horse Show. And, uh, you know, the media kind of blew that thing all out of proportion, uh, you know, about uh, with um, the horse show and the fair having their issues, but everything's worked out everything's now. Everything's good. They're it's one happy family. Love. Yes, everything's great. And really, the fair at the heart of it is the horse show. Right. So we got to kick off with the uh, opening ceremony. And you've been part of this a long, long time. Just the, the fact that the people were leaning on you and Ken to get this done, because there was a possibility at one point this might not have happened. Absolutely. I think between us, though, we, we never doubted that we would make it happen. Uh, it's, it's, you know, very important, a lot of history for both of us. Uh, for me especially, my parents ran the show back at the old fairgrounds, and uh, it was important to, to continue it on. It's been a magnificent show, and we want to keep it up to the level it once was. Alan, what do we expect to see here at the ceremonies tonight? Uh, opening ceremonies uh, this year is going to be taking us from the old fairground in 1976, actually back to 1940, to the new location. We're going to show the transition of how a horse and rider looked in the 70s coming here versus 
the glitz and the bling of today's day. We were here to celebrate the, the history of the Sussex County Horse Show in affiliation with the New Jersey State Fair. This represents the 76th anniversary of the Sussex County Horse Show. This is such a big part of the whole experience of the fair. What can people expect this week when they come over here to the ring? Well, from the scheduling standpoint, we just finished up with the traditional three-day AQHA series. And now today is the opening ceremonies for the Hunter Jumper class throughout the remainder of the show. It's now time for the Comet Security, the official security company of a New Jersey State Fair. Fair goer of the day, man. <laughs> Folks, it's now time for the Comet Security, the official security company of New Jersey State Fair, Fair Go Over Day. I'm here at Mike Madden of Century Lake. How you doing, Mike? How you like the fair so far? Very good. Everything, everything's working out great for us so far. What do you like most about coming to the fair? Uh, just interacting with the people that are that are out at the fair, the people that are, uh, you know, the camps that are coming by, the senior citizens, people that we don't normally see on a regular basis in our retail store that we get to see out at the fair. I tell me what. Give a little plug for our good friends over there at Century Lake, the number one internet in the area. Talk about what you guys are promoting right now. Right now we're promoting our uh, our bundle pricing, um, which gives you internet and your home telephone service. We give you a good internet price at $19.99. Uh, that's a five-year price guarantee uh, with no contract. That's our best available offer. We also have great partnerships with DirecTV. And uh, DirecTV right now, they're running uh, good specials for any football fans out there. They're offering NFL Sunday ticket for anybody who's a new customer. You sign up for DirecTV, you get Sunday ticket for the upcoming season for free. How's everything working out uh, with the sales this week? So far, so good. We've got a lot of people that are interested, a lot of people that are uh, unfamiliar with us from out of the area, but we're able to spread the word and let them share you know, our, our goodies here, our pens, and you know, any of the prize wheel giveaways that we're doing as well. Mike, a pleasure. Thank you. Thank you. There you go, Mike Madden, the player go over day here at the New Jersey State Fair, Sussex County Farm and Horse Show. The fair go over day sponsored by Comet Security, folks. They have a number one security. Uh, they also do property management in the area, and they're the official security company of New Jersey State Fair, Jim Flanagan and Craig Thompson. We thank them for their sponsorship and more coverage of a New Jersey State Fair. All right, folks, this adorable little girl, you'd never know. She is Jerry Morelli's little pumpkin, Gina Joy. She has grown up so adorable, and what we love about her is she likes to make fun of her father. So, Gina, <laughs> would you like to imitate your dad for us yeah. on television? Go ahead. Oi, Jerry! <laughs> I just lost your cable company. Sherry, stop yelling at Gina! Stop me! Oh, oh Jerry! <laughs> Do mommy when she yells at me. Be quiet! <laughs> Get the phone, Jerry! Stop eating muffins! <laughs> no! <laughs> no! Well, folks, you have just been invited to the Morelli household. Now you know oh, what goes on behind a, closed doors. I'm cooked. Gina, that, folks, I don't even know what else to say. We gotta just close the show. That was the best imitation I've ever seen, my love. Good job, honey. Great job. Big things in your future. Get a job. I thought when she's 14, what do you got to do when you're 14? Mugs. Get a job. Support yourself. <laughs> yeah. Well, you're going to have to get a job. Oh my God, Waiting tables at Casa Mia, babysitting. Hysterical. Get a job when you're 14. Pay for your own college and your own car. Okay, wow. that's right. What a drag. But, well, All right. Nikki, I mean, uh, <laughs> not everybody has the life that you had growing up, Nikki. Mom. <laughs> All right, Tyler. <laughs> you can ask my dad. All I right. always uh, have a job. Uh, all right, okay. I might have gotten fired yeah. from you. <laughs> might have, but I all had right. my job. We know George the care. He's a good man. Though. We love that. We love George. <laughs> right. uh, you want to close the show? <laughs> all right, folks. We've been having a great time for all of our uh, countrymen, servicemen, servi servicing for our country, for all the people here at the fair, having fun for Gina Joy Morelli. One thing is, is Governor Crispy going to be here this year? I, I don't know. The one, sure came, he will. the one year he came, he had his pants up to the ear like with a rocker look, shirt on, walking like around, you. taking pictures like Santa Claus. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to Christie. This guy's out of control, <laughs> folks. We better cut it. For Jerry Morelli, Nikki Morville, we bid you a hearty good night.